gonna hit him while he's down. Cause that's the kind of hero I am. <sighs> Hello everyone and welcome once again to Psychonauts, where it's time for some brain power. At least I think so. Buy a cobweb duster at the camp store. You know, if you want to get through the dust. Otherwise, you know, probably not. Buy it. Buy a dowsing rod at the camp it's store. This guy needs a duffel bag tag. I see. That's a shame. Oh my God! The I orphanage. That's I don't think that's good. Okay. I see. Ah, crap. Oh, that was weird. Ah, oh, cool. That's handy. Ow. They just should use this. Like this. Like this, you freak. I think I gotta go this way, yeah. Come on, what do you got, huh? Your projectiles are nothing to me. Oh, crap. Didn't do it fast enough. There we go. Go to Kachamara Tower and destroy it. Destroy the prison to free the pilot. Fair enough. Sorry, do not destroy the pilot. Oh, I love this barrier. When I actually bother to use it properly. But sometimes I do not. In fact, very often I do not. Almost all the time I do not. I barely even use it. What's this? Some kind of blimp. Perhaps I should pop that blimp with my powers. I have amazing powers. Is this yours? I need the purse tag here. Okay, fair enough. Okay, I'll destroy it. First. Oh, right. Okay, I guess that didn't work. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting when I map things, too. Yeah. There we go. I don't think that's gonna work. No, yeah, not that. Oh, okay. I guess you can't do that at the same time. What did I... I know I did something to lock onto things. I think it's this... Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Punch vault open. Very well, then. Oh, whoops. Lungfishopolis under siege. There, everyone's all happy. And then someone came in. That's Coach. It's Coach is te basically oppressing them. That is messed up, yo. Real messed up, yo. I, I better help the resistance. There you go. Freedom! 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 The freedom! freedom! So, this big monster, is that the best you could do? We were short on time, and he is good at smashing things. <laughs> Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. Hey, you're welcome. Sorry about him, Gargalore. He's been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the Resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Really? Meet us at the dam so we can put it into action. My bad. I keep forgetting. Okay, cool. So I don't have to destroy the blimp. They'll pilot the blimp. The blimp is my ally. Cool. Let's just destroy the rest of the prison while we're at it. You know, lawlessness bounds everything. <laughs> that's what you get, coach. I don't think that's gonna work. I don't think that's you gonna like work. bringing order to things? Well, I'm just gonna say screw you. Let's do lawlessness instead. We're gonna keep the prisoners now. Don't worry. I don't intend to kill any of you. Well, except for you. You probably had it coming. I could say it was an accident, but let's be real, you probably had it coming. Ow. Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gargalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common low-life criminals. Earlier tonight, 
Dogalor broke some of his jailhouse cronies out of the slammer so they could enjoy a night on the town, popping pills and soliciting inexpensive call girls. Well, they're in for one nasty hangover. Our beloved Navy has come up with a high-tech new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity. Kidnapping children do not harm the brains. That's not good. Good thing this still works. And buildings are still very much influencing it. That was messy. I don't think that's gonna work. Yeah, and be careful of water, even in here. Probably, I'm, I'm assuming. New story already. Destruction and terror continue as the hulking, godless child beast carves a bloody spar through our helpless city. Our noble, all volunteer navy has been surprised only by the senseless lust for mayhem that seeps from the twisted black lump of a heart in this creature, still known only as Gogalore. Though it loathes violence in all its forms. The Navy has no choice but to activate its anti-monster turrets, which it guarantees are 100% monster-proof. Not get caught stealing children. Okay. Let's, um, go over there. There was a tag over there that I didn't grab. My bad. Might be helpful. Okay, that's not too bad. Take this, you freak. Oh wait, good. This building isn't getting destroyed immediately. I love you, Gargalore. You're welcome, Gargalore. First, Gargalore says you're welcome, and that he loves you too. Probably as friends, platonically. I have all the platonic love for all of you. Gargalore says platonic love, baby. Oh, thank goodness for help. Right, I keep forgetting. That might help. Though the barrier seems to be very helpful too. I should probably use the barrier more. Where is that briefcase? Um, somewhere around here. Hey, I would appreciate this. If you all would quit attacking me, I would only have minimal damage to your buildings. I swear. There he is. Hey, buddy. I'm here to help you. Here's your tag. You have been tagged. Now, there's a parallel that can be made here about them being so happy to be tagged. But hey, you know what? I'm not going to follow that train of logic. Even though now I implanted the suggestion into your head. And now you got to live with it. You're welcome. <laughs> I don't think that's going to work. Too bad that doesn't work here. At least not well, it immediately pops. Probably just as contrived. Holy smokes! Those goggles are 5,000 meters tall! Hey, you wanna see out of them? Might burn your eyes a little. But hey, what's a little eye burn between friends, huh? You all provoke this! Now I have to destroy your buildings to get back health. Oh, no! Oh, my Get this tail. to yourselves! No! You did this to yourselves. This is your punishment for my for your defiance. Gargalore has decreed it. You deserve punishment for your defiance. Gargalore, we'll destroy you. Oh, jeez, okay. Break. This is very bad. I'm gonna die. Gargalore is gonna die. Oh boy. There we go. Ah, now you see the genius of our plan, Gargalore. First we print flyers. Then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Longfishopolis in as soon as six months. Six months? You don't like our plan, you can come up with another one. Yes, we are busy. We have to select cardstock and then find a decent but inexpensive printer within the week. Why'd you go to the dam then? 
Are you out of your damn mind? My car! <laughs> wink, wink. My jeans shop! Shut up. You did this to yourselves. Gargalore is very disappointed in all of you. Gargalore does no longer feeling platonic love for any of you. Gargalore is only feeling hatred and destruction. You treated Gargalore different and see where it's gotten you. Gargalore is very displeased. You should not interfere with Gargalore's plans. You should not have done that. Now you will pay the price. My tank! There's a price to pay. I will kill all of you. I will actually justify the coach's actions here. Because why not? You all hate me anyway. May as well give you a reason to hate me, huh? No survivors. Put out the hearts and minds all right by splattering them on the ground. Anyway, time to move. Also, I can get new power. Hey! Oh, cool. Knock it off! No, I don't think so. Hey, let go. Let it go, let it go, there we go, I found it in this pile. Let it go, I will stop, that song is really old. Reach Skyscraper Island. I mean, if I, if I tear down this dam, it will flood everywhere. And then there will be no one left to defy me. Because clearly that's what I'm trying to do. Only the rebels will be spared. That's how we win this war. Or something. That's probably not what the game wants me to do, I'm guessing. Yeah. What's this? What do we have here? There we go, astral projection layer restored. Very nice. I now have five lives. Baby. Although I did get a purse tag, maybe I should go all the way over there. Really wish my floaty worked right now. I don't think that's gonna work. I don't think that's gonna work. It would really come in handy right now, is all I'm saying. Sucks. Oh well, fine. The purse will have to remain without a tag. So sorry. Hey, get back here. I need healing. By destroying. I need destruction so that I may heal. That's how Gargalore functions. He must destroy in order to live. It's a sad existence, most would say. Oh boy. Ah, okay, that was bullshit. You couldn't have known I'd be in that exact location. I call bull. Although I already said shy, so I may as well just keep it on. Keep it that train of thought. Oh yeah, boy. That nigga did that for damn. Barrier on. They have heat seeking. That makes them dangerous, very dangerous to me, my health, and I, and everything else, you son of a bitch. I will kill all of you. You will all feel my wrath. There will be no survivors. I would have been content with just stopping coach, but since you have chosen to defy me, I'm going to destroy all of you. That's the way it has to be. I need my help, and you're not providing it for me, willingly, so I'm gonna have to take it out of your ass. Sorry, that's the way it's gotta be. I'm not sorry. In the slightest. I've got barriers and everything else. I've got superpowers. You really think you can defy me? Forever? The answer is you cannot. You want to make a monster out of me? Well, guess what? The monster has been awakened in full. 
I know I, I technically already did that, but whatever. 71. Not bad. I just gotta claw back some health. Luckily I can do this by destroying things. And justifying them. Justifying them to hate me. Say, hey, I'm a sport about this. I would be more than happy to justify them and give them an excuse. Because Lord knows I love excuses for destruction. <laughs> so why not give them some excuses for destruction? Hey, we'll give each other excuses for destruction. Let's see who's better at it. Spoiler alerts, it might just be the big boy. So take that. Sucker. What do you say to me now, dirtbag? The suitcase tag is on the way. New news alert. We're here with the star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take on the Gogalore situation? Is he just misunderstood? No way! I hate Gogalore! I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. Buddy, you'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. <laughs> Airplanes! So rest assured, we can all look forward to Gogalore's imminent death. To seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LBC. Thanks, and okay, I'd just then. like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Gogalore, come in. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Kochamara Channel, to get to Kochamara Island, and destroy Kochamara Tower! The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we... uh... uh we just think it best to... to where... Uh, uh... We've decided to maintain our position out here. Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. For insurance reasons, Gargalore. Yes, that, and for freedom. Okay, then. For freedom! Crap, okay. Damn it. Skyscraper Island. Destroy all the planes so the freighters can dock. Yeah, I should probably get on that, huh? Let's King Kong this sheep. Climb the highest building and then swat them out of the air. And then tragically die because beauty killed the beast or something. I don't know. Peter Jackson's King Kong. I don't think that's gonna. I don't think that's right. Gonna... Okay. Hey, I don't appreciate you smacking me. Only I may smack. So quit the smacking, or I will smack you into the next century. I swear to God. Gogolore is displeased with all of you, and he will destroy until there is nothing left. He hath made his decision. You are screwed, saith Gargalor. Gargalor hath decreed that you are boned. And if you say anything otherwise, you're gonna be doubly boned, and you don't want to be doubly boned. Singularly boned is bad enough. I'm better than King Kong. King Kong didn't have a mind laser. One more to go. Ah, shite. Hurry up and climb back up, you idiot. There we go. That's freedom! The last. the last bastion of freedom is here. You're next, coach. You're next. He did say something about underneath the lake. Come on. Let's get up there. Proceed to the Tower Island to destroy the radio tower. Oh, I see. We're gonna take out his broadcast once and for all. Then once the lungfish can actually think for themselves, things might get a little different here. 
Coach's control over this lungfish is about to come to a screeching halt, all right. Poor lungfish. Ah, oh, here we go. There you go, luggage. Good thing I happen to be in the area. There's no way I'm making a return trip of, significant, of significance. Oh, wait a minute. I can fast travel, I think. If I found another one. I don't think fast travels work in this world. I don't think they exist, rather. I don't think there are any for me to be found. I don't remember actually finding any. So that's a shame. That, that purse will have to remain untagged. Because my stupid self forgot. Sorry. Apologies. Probably gonna bother the hell out of me now. Oh well. I'm Gogalore. What do I care about the emotions of others? Even a suitcase and purse. Brains. Oh, that was nice. A double jump maneuver there. That you saw that. I did that so beautifully. Oh, I see. I can jump from boat to boat. They're serving as platforms for me. That's so nice of them to offer themselves up for the mighty Gargalore. Seems this is the final showdown, Coach. Well, we're sorry to report that the miserable and incompetent Lungfish Navy is all but sunk. Great work, losers. Now, Kochamara himself will have to come all the way down here just to save our worthless hides. Authorities are calling for a big parade in Kochamara's honor after he clobbers the annoying giant Gagalore. And if the parade is big enough, Kochamara promises not to destroy the city. Brush teeth more often, don't do so much. He's probably gonna destroy the city trying to take me down. He doesn't care. I mean, I don't care either, but, you know, at least I'm not pretending to. I need more help. Hey, everyone! Here comes Kochamara! Oh, he was vulnerable! 
vulnerable for a second. Ground vision. He was vulnerable for a second. Ah, take that, coach. Take that, bitch. combination. to avoid area attack. Take this, coach. Oh, the sky made that hard to see. And the barrier. His sky made his health hard. Ground vision. Ah, oh, crap. Overly intricate combination! That's not gonna help. Hard to avoid! Area attack! Take this, coach. Oh. You gonna give up now? I become too powerful for you to contain. Gogalore has become your match. Take that, coach. I'm coming for you. You better watch your a hole. April of Munfishopolis. I'm sorry I let you down. Oh. Finally. Okay, Tower. Get ready for Gogalore. Yeah. Gogalore is gonna wreck your shit, baby. <laughs> I'm just gonna hit him while he's down. Cause that's the kind of hero I am. Dun dun dun! <laughs> Oh look, I'm almost at full health. May as well complete this at full health, you know? Just as an extra screw you to coach. He couldn't even leave me with damaged health. Because once I figured out how to beat him, he's actually easy. But I mean, given the nature of the game, it's forgivable more than forgivable. Huh, look at that. You can tell this was on PS2. Not too bad, though. Although, upscaling it does not do it any favors. For insurance... reasons. You. Oh, boy. <laughs> I made him destroy it himself. You idiot. Cool. Fine. Take control of this freaky toad. I don't need him to nap children for me anymore. I've got the brain of a little girl back in my lab that's strong enough to power a whole army of psychoblaster death tanks. Huh? <laughs> what? You've got the brain of a little girl? <laughs> I said, in my lab. I think you've got the muscles of a little girl, too. <laughs> <sighs> Good one. Thanks, but that's not my name. Human child. <laughs> who is that? It is I, the creature whose spirit was once, um, <clears throat> over here, behind you. Yeah, yes. take a look. The creature whose spirit was once enslaved by the evil one. You have unchained my soul. And now I shall repay you, powerful human child. Oh. Could you help me free everybody? Uh, well, okay. Show me what you did to my friend Lily. By the drowned spirit of Oblongata, it is done. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's lovely. Um, okay. I hope that, um, hope where I end up is good. Hopefully I can save her and not get eaten myself. Imagine if it just gave me up to coach, too. Oh, it's a portal. To his lab. Or, okay. I see. When it is your wish to travel across the lake, you may return to either shore and summon me with that. Thanks, hulking lungfish. You know, you really aren't as hideous as people say. You may call me now by my true name, Rasputin. 
The name given to me by my people. And what name is that, noble lake creature? Linda. Linda. What a magical lady. Linda. See you, Linda. Linda, Linda, Linda. It's time to fight. Unfortunately, I'm all out of time, so that'll have to wait. That is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like coaches near to well doings. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and very pleasant day. And remember, Gogolore wishes you a happy day too. <laughs> see you later now. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.